Hello, my name is Dan Evans. I am the company director for Expressive Arts Productions and we're hoping to raise money for an exciting new feature film, Frozen in Time. Frozen in Time is about a scientist who travels back in time to save his wife from death. It's an incredible journey of one man's determination and passion to travel back to alter his past and subsequently alter his future for the one person he truly loves. Frozen in Time has been in development now for about two and a half years. The script was written by an American writer called James McClung. Uh, he's a great writer. Um, when I received the first treatment of the script I was just, wow, we have something special here. So I've probably made films since my very early teens doing stop motion. Uh, from then I did short films with friends and, and you know for uh, 48 hour movie competitions, uh, one of which I did a, a, a Star Wars film for college which was quite fun. I did all the effects as well. From then I was involved in a couple of short films called Expresso and Waiting in Rhyme, which featured actors such as Sir Norman Wisdom, Jeff Hughes, Sally Lindsay, Les Dennis, uh, quite a, a good mix of actors there. And that was my real shot of doing something quite extraordinary. So I've always had a passion for film, but when you work with people like that and being on a, an actual film set, it ignited something in me and a, a passion that this is something that I want to do for the rest of my life. In 2009, I set up my own production company and I work with organisations across the UK in the corporate sector, commercial sector, I make uh, music videos, short films, uh, I, I shoot events and weddings, but ultimately where I want to be is making big feature films. In 2010, uh, I finally got one of my projects off the ground called Music. It was self-financed and we got a great cast and we were lucky enough to work with Jeremy Bullock at Pinewood Studios. Those of you who have seen Star Wars, Jeremy Bullock played Boba Fett, uh, one of the iconic uh, baddies in the movies, which is great. In terms of the casting for the film, we already have two of the actors already signed up for the film. The reason I'm so excited about this script is it's uplifting, entertaining, and completely unpredictable. The idea of an alternate reality or a time continuum is something that has been toyed with a lot in film, but Frozen in Time, I think, does it just a little bit better. Not only do you have this idea of science fiction and a fantasy reality that we all kind of wish that we could do, but there's also a great love story in this film. When I, I read Frozen in Time, I just thought it was fantastic. It was really well written, it was clever, uh, intelligent. The character of Walter was, was intriguing. We all want some companion who truly, truly cares about us and would do anything for us. And the main character, Walter, who's my husband, pretty much does that for me. I found that uh, he would do anything he could to, to gain back those couple of minutes where he might, might have been able to save her. That kind of characterization really appealed to me and uh, it, it bounced off the, you know, off the page and I could really see it on the screen and I was, uh, I was very excited by it. He works really diligently on making this time machine, almost kind of taking me for granted a little bit. And when a nearly fatal or possibly fatal, and I want to give away too much, accident occurs, he works completely diligently to try to save me. He has this partner and there's all these different times they go back and as you're reading through the script you're not really sure what's going to happen. It's a fascinating journey scientifically as well as you know uh, story-wise. He risks his own insanity, possible death, anything for the one person that he loves and I think that's something that all of us as a human race can relate to and aspire to. Plus, you know, it's cool when you have all the futuristic stuff. Anyhow, I'm thrilled to be a part of this project and I'm really hoping that you will be in support of Frozen in Time also. Thank you. However, there are still two roles that yet to be filled. We have already approached actors Tom Felton and David Tennant for the roles, so we are reaching out to you guys all over the world to help support this project. Because the film project requires a substantial amount of money, what we have done is broken the film um, aspects of it into phases so it's a lot more manageable and the target required for each phase can be more achievable. In this phase, phase one, 
We're hoping to raise £8,000 which will pay for the writer, it will pay for the storyboard artists and concept illustrators, uh, the production manager and also the set designers. Once we have these in place, we are able then to, to visualise the film. We know that this film is going to be a massive hit. It's got a subject of time travel, it's got a love story, it's got a drama. It's going to be brilliant. However, we still need your help and support, even if you can't contribute financially, if you can help spread the word, share this Kickstarter page with all your friends and family. We not only want to build a financial structure for the film, we also want to create an audience. So thank you in advance for helping in any way you can, pledging your support, because without you, this film is never going to get made. We want this film to be one of the biggest community driven films in the world and to do that we need your help.